I'm alone. There's no one here beside me. My problems have all gone. There's no one to deride me. Welcome to the start of what is going to be my finals week. Weeks. Vlog. My finals week. Weeks. Vlog. If you didn't catch it from the intro, I currently have the apartment to myself. So I feel like I can be as loud as I want. Don't have to feel embarrassed if I mess up speaking in front of the camera. It's just embarrassing. And so it's better if no one can hear me. But I'm all alone, so nobody can hear me. Woohoo! It's a Saturday, but it is... Whoa, why am I blue? I don't know what to do about it. Yeah, so have the apartment to myself, and it's a Saturday. Brie, what are you gonna do? Um, maybe I will throw a party, or maybe I'll go to a party, or maybe I will do none of that because I have to stay home and work on my finals because I'm drowning, which is why I'm so blue right now. I am currently underwater because I'm drowning because I am underwater, okay? Yeah, so that's actually what I'm going to be doing. I am going to be staying home and working on a paper that I have due and a final presentation that I have due, final story that I have to do, which is all due literally three days in a row. No breaks, no breaks in grad school. No breaks. Listen, I might still have to work on finals, but I can at least pretend like I'm enjoying a Saturday off. This doesn't taste as good as I remember. Actually, it's good. I don't think I just got too much fun. I feel like I should also mention that the last two days before this, I had a migraine. That's right, I had a migraine that lasted two days, so I am currently two days behind, which is pretty tragic. Probably shouldn't be drinking anything considering today is the first day I've woken up without a migraine, and alcohol can obviously increase the chances of getting another migraine. So that has been my life the last couple of days. It was actually really bad. I can't even lie. I had to leave class early on Thursday because I got too nauseous and I couldn't sit there any longer. Took six ibuprofen <laughs> because I'm out of Excedrin. And they didn't do anything. I woke up the next day and I still had a headache. I burnt through four different ice packs. I didn't take more Advil until the very next night after the first day because I'm not trying to overdo it on the ibuprofen. I just was desperate. Brain fog is very much still there. It took me a minute to think of the word motivation earlier today. So that was a... <laughs> Starting this paper should be pretty interesting because I can't think of words right now, so. Ah! So, I have a page and I made some popcorn. <laughs> Well folks, my evening's coming to a close. I wish I could say I did some exciting things, but instead I just spent the last four hours rewriting the same page. It was the introduction, to be fair. Introduction is always the hardest part for me, so. That's it for tonight. I'll see ya in the morning. Okay, bye. <sighs> so, I am apparently cursed. I woke up with another headache. Yesterday. And alcohol can obviously increase the chances of getting another migraine. I'm not gonna say migraine, because I don't think it's there yet. But here's the thing about me. I don't just get headaches. That means that if I get a headache, there's about a 99% chance it's gonna turn into a migraine. My issue the last couple of days is that I haven't had any Excedrin. Advil, Tylenol, Ibuprofen. None of that works for me. Out of desperation, I was like, you know what? Let me try this new app called GoPuff and see if they can't deliver me some Excedrin because I don't want to walk somewhere because when I have a migraine or headache, my whole face and head are very sensitive. And so putting on a mask, I feel like would just speed up the migraine X 
exponentially. So I was like, I'll just order and see if it works. I've never tried this app before. I downloaded it, I'm like, oh cool, they have all these options. They had Excedrin and Excedrin Extra Strength. So I got both. Place the order, it says it's, you know, being processed, all that stuff. I'm like, great. Go out, make my coffee. I'm like, I'm gonna get some caffeine in me, then get my Excedrin, take that, and I'll be good to go. And then I get a phone call, and I'm like, okay, maybe they just were early. And I answer, and it was a lady, a very nice lady, but she did crush my dreams and told me that they are out of both Excedrins. So that's my morning. That's how we're starting off the day. Usually, I would just lay around around until the migraine subsided. I don't really have that option anymore because I'm running out of days to work on stuff. So I think I'm just going to try and push through. Not the worst headache I've ever had. Could easily turn into the worst headache I've ever had. But um, I think I'm just going to push through and just hope it goes away, right? Ignorance is bliss. If I pretend I don't have it, I don't have it. Anyways, just wanted to share that with you. I'm not going to film for a hot minute because I forgot to charge my camera battery last night because I am the absolute worst, okay? Just wanted to tell you that. So, I haven't picked up my camera in approximately one year and a half. I promise I've been working really hard. But I'm gonna take a break to make dinner. Um, tater tot pizza. Tater tot taco pizza. That's what I'm at. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cover the bottom inside of a greased 12 inch cast iron skillet. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. I'm gonna do this. Huh. Bake at 425, but the bag says 375. Oh, I should chop up some onions first. My eyes fire! are absolutely on fire. Heavy oven preheating. I decided to go for 400 since that's kind of right in the middle of the two suggestions. Why is it spicy? It's fine. I'm good. Okay, dear God. I am cooking up the onions a little bit, and I got to cook the ground beef. Oh, I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me. I'm sweating, so I'm supposed to smash the tater tots. All right, here's the finished product. This is Colt's first time trying it. Yep. Mmm, yummy. I won't film you taking a bite. <laughs> okay, I'm not, I'm not filming. <laughs> is it any good? good? On a scale of one to 10, what would you rate it? You can be honest. It's like a six and a half. I was thinking seven, seven and a half. Pretty good. 